What's up guys, Philip here and I am back in the garage to talk to y'all today about the massage gun that I picked up a few months ago and that is the Bob and Brad C2 massage gun. So let's talk about it a little bit. So why did I get a massage gun? Well, for a while I felt like it would be a superfluous purchase and it would not really provide the benefit for what it cost. But when I sustained my in injury, which a lot of y'all know about at this point, um, I felt like it would be a great opportunity to um, use to break up some of that scar tissue um, as well as loosen some of those muscles. And that is uh, really what it is advertised as being used for. Um, it's advertised as being able to promote blood flow to areas, uh, loosen muscles up, break up scar tissue, and the such. So um, do I think that it is worth the money? Um, let's see. So let's discuss first what you get when you buy the Bob and Brad C2 massage gun. So first of all, it comes with this nice little hard case, uh, which I really, really like. I like the feeling of it. I like how it looks and I like the handle that it has. It has a rubberized little handle and it's a very neat package. So once you open that up, you get a few things. First of all, it does come with a charger to charge it, that's pretty important. Um, and it comes with a manual to use it. Now, after those things, you get the actual massage gun, if I can take it out. Um, and it's not very big, guys. This is something that I absolutely love about it. Um, it does have a big enough handle to hold and it's rubberized. Um, so even if you have a big hand, um, there's plenty to grab onto. Um, don't make that weird, first of all, some of you out there, um, but the handle is plenty big to grab onto and grip. And again, it does have a nice grippy rubber on it, so I really like that about it. It feels very solid. Um, it is built very well, and it's not very big. It's about a one and a half pound, so I really didn't want something ginormous um, when I bought a massage gun. So with the massage gun, you get five different attachments. So it comes with this little one to get more, um, I guess, deep tissue. I mean, if something's really hurting, if you have some pretty bad inflammation, it can really dig in there. Um, you have this kind of like little cushiony one, um, which I really don't use a lot. You have this one, which I like to call the war hammer, um, which I, again, I don't really use a lot. And you have this, the little ball one, it is like a, a firm, kind of foam type feeling. And this is probably the one that, that I use the most. You can see the deodorant on it, um, as a matter of fact. So use this one the most. At last, you have this little fork, which I really don't use much at all, but it would be pretty good for around your spine. I believe that's what it is meant to be used for. So how do you use this? So this is the massage gun without an attachment. <clears throat> All you do is you take the end of the attachment and you press it firmly in there and it's good. See, it has a small layer of rubber around it. Let me make sure all of them do. Yeah, they all have a small, very thin layer of rubber that grips into the attachment point. So you just press it until that rubber is in there and it is ready to go. Now, how do you turn it on and off? You hold the button a few seconds to turn it on and it starts going. Now at this point, the back shows you that you can use, I believe it is five, yep, five different um, intensity levels that you uh, switch between by just clicking the button. And then back down to nothing. And then it starts again. So. You pick the level that you want to use, get done using it, okay, you're done with it. You just hold that back button, that power button, again, a couple more seconds to turn it off. So very simple to use, very user-friendly. Um, it does have a little, little gauge, just four little dots that um, indicate the battery life. So that is how you know how much it's charged. Um, and this is how you know what intensity it is at. So that's just kind of the basics of how to use this.
While I can't tell you that I'm overly familiar with the metrics of massage guns, I can tell you bottom line that for its size, this Bob and Brad C2 massage gun provides plenty of force and feels very, very well built. Even at an intermediate range, you can get plenty of force against that muscle if it is hurting you or if you just need some release. Works pretty well. So bottom line, do I recommend this Bob and Brad C2 massage gun? Well, I would say absolutely. It is on sale pretty frequently on Amazon. fact I believe it is about 110 today and I got it um, during a sale a few months back for 90 so keep your eyes out find it at its sale price and it is well worth the money I hope you guys enjoyed this review I hope you found it informative and if you have any other questions on topics that I didn't cover regarding this massage gun or massage guns in general drop a comment down in the comment section below and anybody who also has this massage gun drop a comment also and tell us what you think about it i appreciate you guys watching this and i will catch you guys later